Hey y'all, how you guys doing? Okay, let's do a quick little reading. I know I've been away. <laughs> All right, let's see what's coming for you guys for the next 24 to 48 hours. What's coming for my beautiful collective watching this? The next 24 to 48 hours, spirit. Next 24 to 48 hours. What's coming for them? Moving. <laughs> okay, somebody could be moving. This reading is for somebody that's going to be moving within the next 24 to 48 hours. <laughs> okay, there's somebody on this card packing or they're some of you guys could be hiring movers or you're gonna maybe you're going to be moving boxes carrying boxes or some of you guys could do this for a living you guys could be a mover professional movers wow somebody's moving in the next 24 to 48 hours What else? 24 to 48 hours. Fake busy. Okay, somebody could be fake busy. Take this where this resonates. Or you could be busy moving. Unemployed, broke, fired, living beyond their means. Some of you guys could be eating takeout or you're getting ready to be eating takeout. Netflix and chill. Sneaking around, friends with benefits, spending time with someone else. Some of you guys are going to be watching TV. Broken mirrors, addictions, roller coaster, toxic connections. Okay, so somebody's moving. This may be somebody unemployed moving. What else? Next 24 to 48 hours. Not enough. Okay, somebody in this card is blindfolded. Their hands are tied. Lacking confidence, self-sabotage, ego in fear, frustrations. Okay, somebody feels like they're not enough. Good lady and letter number six and number seven. Okay, there could be some kind of communication going on, letters. Next four, 24 to 48 hours. So somebody's moving. They're going to be busy moving, it looks like. Nine of Pentacles. Wow. Ten of Wands. Yeah. Okay. There's definitely going to be somebody moving, carrying a lot of stuff. 
maybe heavy stuff. Somebody is very comfortable financially though with the Nine of Pentacles. So maybe this is the end of somewhere where someone's living. This is the end of your time of living where you're living or something. This is the end of something. Higher font. This could be a Taurus. Okay, what, how I'm saying this, this is the end of some kind of something with your belief systems, limiting beliefs. Somebody's been having this, these thoughts or beliefs like they're not enough, fear, lacking confidence, or lack, lack mentality. This is the end of something like that. Judgment. Yeah, this you're preparing for a new life, a new destination it looks like. Something is permanently ending. It looks like it's for the better. Pluto. Pluto, Venus. You may be moving somewhere better or some more nicer it looks like somebody's already made up their decision they've already made up their mind with something with moving Six of Wands. Yeah, you're you're overcoming something very hard. You've been going through a, a tough cycle, it looks like. You're wrapping up, ending a tough cycle. Choosing to move or move in a new direction. Some of you guys, maybe you've been unemployed. Maybe you're finding a job or something. Maybe you've been broke. This is something to do with your value, your self-value too here. Yeah, Eight of Swords, top of the deck. Maybe you've been in fear, self-sabotaging, Knight of Pentacles. Something's been happening slowly or some kind of slow progress. Somebody's commitment could have been being tested this could be something about a, a relationship, a marriage. You're successfully overcoming something. You're moving on to this new path where there's going to be a lot of success, victory, possibly a lot of wealth. This could be affluence. This could be some kind of rewards, uh, a raise, a promotion. And this feels like overall it's a level up. You're leveling up in life. You're moving to the next stage in life. You've been very busy or something like that. This energy feels like moving on up. It's like something like that. Maybe you've been overcoming some kind of addictions or something, or you didn't like who you seen in the mirror. Maybe you're, you're getting out of a toxic connection. Yeah, this could be somebody receiving a letter. Maybe you did receive a letter or communication or you're about to. I feel like this is going to be good news, though. What else? The next 24 to 48 hours. Ace of Pentacles. Yes, there's something new here, an increase. An increase, a raise, could be new money, a new venture, 
a new house, new car, something big. Four of Pentacles. Yeah, this is this is more financial security coming into your life. Yeah, you possibly been um, hoarding money, holding on to money, scarcity mindset, lack of mindset. Maybe you're breaking out of that. Some of you guys, this could be something where there was some kind of natural disaster. It looks like a house fire or something right here. Yeah, somebody's been hoarding money or something. That's all ending. Maybe this is the end of a period in your life where you was broke or something. You're getting ready to have plenty of uh, money, plenty of wealth. This is a lot of abundance, abundance and prosperity in this energy. Could be a uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Spirit's telling me something like there's no need to cry. Ten of Pentacles. There's definitely no need to cry, honey. Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, look at all these Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. So we all could have a family, uh, kids, animals, pets. Okay, yeah. I feel like somebody's moving to a new house or a new area. It's like you are about to... I'm here in upper class. You could be, you're about to be living like a lifestyle, like be upper class or something. Maybe you've been in like the lower class, middle class. You're about to be in the upper class is what I'm hearing. You're about to be having more money than you've ever had ever. This could be about something you've accumulated. I'm here accumulating. This could have something to do with your faith, your faith, your faith being tested, something with God, something spiritual, something religious with the higher fonts. It's like you're being crowned. You passed like a test or something. You passed like a spiritual test. God was testing you. You you thought you was going to fail or lose it all or something like that. What else next? 24 to 48 hours. Two of Wands. Yeah. You are currently making some kind of plans. Thinking about your next destination. The next path ahead. Somebody's definitely planning on moving. Some of you guys, you you. this doesn't have to be like you're going to move the next 24 to 48 hours. But this could just be you thinking about this. Thinking about something with a move being busy or something like that chilling Netflix and chilling you could be thinking about this in the next 24 to 48 hours thinking about some of y'all are going to get a letter or something a letter thinking about some kind of communication judgment to wands yeah you made a final decision about where you want to go or what you want to do There could be something in this energy that's being restored, resurrected. Yeah. I'm hearing something like trial and error. Trial and error. Something like that is what I'm hearing. Some of you guys, you and your family's getting ready to move. Yeah. Somebody's about to be living like better. This is like a good move, it feels like. Page of Wands, yeah. This is a good, um, exciting move. This could be like a new adventure. This is exciting, fun. 
you're looking forward to this. You're already planning this. You could be communicating this with other people or somebody's going to communicate to you something with the letters here. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Somebody's preparing for a trip, a trip, travel. Some of you guys have so much money that you're about to pay somebody to help you move or something. You're going to hire somebody or hire movers. You're going to hire help. Wow. 24 to 40 hours. Queen of Pentacles. Yeah. Congrats. Top of the deck is four of wands. Congratulations. You may celebrate after this once you reach your destination. Maybe you're going to throw house parties or something like that or celebrate in a house. This could be like a milestone, a wedding, a, a birthday party. This is like paradise. They're in paradise right here on the Four of Wands. Knights of Wands, yeah. Somebody's moving to a certain destination where they're going to be very happy, feel supported. Maybe you're having somebody help you with this move, supporting you on this move. Queen of Pentacles. This is somebody that is um, very stable, financially stable. Maybe you and somebody else with the Knight of Pentacles. Maybe you've been patiently planning this, patiently wait, waiting. Yeah, there could be getting ready to be a wedding for some of you guys. It's like you've been putting some kind of effort into this or hard work. You're about to see your hard work pay off or you're about to see some kind of results. Four to forty eight hours. Don't lose hope. Wow, I knew that was going to come out. Don't lose hope. Something you've been struggling with, maybe feeling like I said, maybe not feeling good enough, lacking confidence, lacking something, and you've been in fear, frustration, self sabotage. Maybe something with your money. Don't lose hope. Your faith is being tested. Practice self-love affirmations. You could be practicing self-love affirmations or practicing affirmations in general. Expect miracles, yeah. Expect miracles, expect good news, expect for this all to work out. You could be getting ready to move somewhere where like you've always dreamed of living or something like that. Spirit telling me something like you're about to call it home. Four to forty eight hours. New opportunities. New opportunity. Don't focus on fear, focus on faith. New opportunity. Yeah, this Ace of Pentacles is a new opportunity for wealth, stability, money, maybe possessions, maybe a house. You're going to go from the Nine of Pentacles to the Ten of Pentacles. Okay, 
what else? 24 to 48 hours. When I'm connected to spirit, I feel a sense of certainty, magnitude, and ease that I've never known before. Something is going to come easily to you. Focus on the certainty. Be certain about this. Be confident about this. Don't doubt yourself or doubt whatever this is. This new path or this move. It's like you've outgrown something or you've outgrown maybe where you're living or a city or something, a state, a country. I heal. Yeah, this is about you healing fear. You've been in this energy of fear. I feel like the divine, I feel like God is trying to help you heal that. God is trying to help you out of these limiting belief systems. I heal the habit of fear and I embrace the habit of love. Beautiful. All right, let's just pull one more card here. Ten of air. Yeah, this is the page of fire again, like the page of wands. A lot of you guys are going to be receiving a letter or news, good news, exciting news. You're going to be like, yes, page of fire, news of an exciting new and diver. Use your originality and ingenuity, outgoing, creative, confidence, mischievous. So the Ten of Air, yeah, it's the end of a difficult situation you've been dealing with. It's the very end of that. The end of a difficult situation. Embrace the changes and expect things to get better now. Recovering from an addiction. You could be recovering from an addiction. This could be some kind of wake-up call. Some of, some of you guys, the universe has been trying to get your attention. Like about a move or a, a decision the universe could be calling you to move a certain place or yeah a certain place or do something or being trying to get your attention to answer the call for some new opportunity maybe a new job new business Memories. Cherish memories of loved ones. This could be something with memories. Memories, something with the past. It's a lot that came out. Knowledge. Seek knowledge. You could be seeking out knowledge, reading, studying, learning something. Or somebody could be teaching you something. Maybe you're going to stumble upon some knowledge that's going to help you in the next 24 to 48 hours. Resilience. Rise above tribulations. Yeah. You've been going through hard trials and tribulations that you're rising above now. There's a ladder here. It's like you're moving on up, climbing up, leveling up. This is a huge level up. This is life changing right here. New beginnings. Yeah, you're about to begin your new life with the judgment. Maybe you've been having revelations about something. It's like, it's like this energy where you, you, you're so scared and so in fear. You feel like you're just going down, down in life and you feel like, dang, like I'm about to hit rock bottom. But like at the last minute, God saves you like whoop. And then like restore something, resurrect something, saves you or something. And then this new beginning starts, this new life starts. It's like a close call or something is what I'm sensing. 
And then this puts you in the Six of Wands. You've been working hard and it's been taking a long time towards something and you're like, dang, is this ever gonna pay off? Am I ever gonna see results? Am I ever gonna get ahead? Am I gonna make it out of this situation? You are. <laughs> you're about to be in the Six of Wands. You're about to be filling this energy within the next 24 to 48 hours. All right. All right, I hope this helps. I hope this resonates. If it does, please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye.